Storm Trucker weather starts now with meteorologist Ryan Dennis. Well, it has been a beautiful start to the work week as we have had partly cloudy skies, dry conditions, and pleasant temperatures throughout the day. And on the Opportunity Bank iCam, we're still seeing those partly cloudy skies right now. And of course, it's nice seeing all that blue sky out there is the smoke in the haze really has not been an issue today and really it hasn't been an issue for the past couple of days now in the capital city. We did top out at 76 degrees, which is right about where we should be for this time of year. And our low temperature was 50 degrees this morning, which was also near average for this time of year. Temperatures right now are currently in the upper 60s and low to mid 70s in most locations, so it does feel very pleasant. 68 degrees in White Sulphur Springs, 75 degrees in Helena, 72 degrees in Jefferson City and Wolf Creek, as well as in Cascade, 69 in Augusta and 71 degrees in Lincoln. And talking about the smoke and haze, again, we're really not dealing with it today, so we are seeing good air quality in almost all locations throughout Montana, but there's still a little bit of smoke in the atmosphere in the southern part of the state, so that's why we do have moderate air quality in some locations. Satellite and radar for most of today has been pretty quiet. We have had clouds around, but for the most part, we have been dry and that's still the case right now. There are a few isolated showers around in north central Montana, but really most locations are currently dry and really throughout the Pacific Northwest. Not too much is going on as high pressure is currently in control of our weather and taking a look at future track as we go through the next few hours, we'll continue to have some isolated showers around mainly in north central Montana. By sunset, though, most of that precipitation will start to dissipate. And overnight tonight, we are going to have mainly clear skies and dry conditions. For your day tomorrow, it's shaping up to be a very nice day of weather. Mainly sunny skies during the morning, then just like today, we'll have partly cloudy skies during the afternoon and evening. And dry conditions are expected tomorrow as well. Partly cloudy skies are expected as we head into tomorrow night. And then for your day on Wednesday, we'll continue to have partly cloudy skies and there will be a couple isolated showers around on Wednesday as a cold front works its way through our area. But again, most locations are going to continue to remain dry. Now in terms of the wind, there was a little bit of a breeze around this afternoon and we'll continue to have a little bit of a breeze around this evening, but by about eight o'clock, the wind's really not going to be an issue overnight tonight. We'll just have a light breeze around and then for most of tomorrow, we'll continue to have a light breeze around, but the wind gusts may approach 20, even 25 miles per hour times tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening. That wind will then diminish tomorrow night, but then on Wednesday, when that cold front works its way through our area, it is going to be very windy, especially Wednesday afternoon and Wednesday evening. Sustained wind speeds between 15 and 25 miles per hour and wind gusts in a lot of locations are going to be approaching 40 miles per hour. And in the Rocky Mountains, we could even see wind gusts approaching 60, even 70 miles per hour in spots. So again, it is going to be very windy for your day on Wednesday. Temperatures tonight, another cool night under those clear skies, upper 30s and low to mid 40s for your lows. Then for your day tomorrow, another pleasant day with high temperatures topping out in the low to mid 70s under mostly sunny skies. We'll stay in the 70s on Wednesday and again it will be windy on Wednesday. Cooler on Thursday thanks to that cold front. We'll be back in the 70s for Friday and then heading into this upcoming weekend. Another cold front is going to work its way through our area. So we are going to have a chance to see some rain showers and thunderstorms and temperatures will cool down in the low to mid 60s for Sunday and Monday.